Pesticide pollution causes 200,000 deaths every single year, but farmers are spraying more than ever around 6 billion pounds of pesticides globally to keep up with rising food demand. Farmers spray about 50 times the amount of pesticides that actually sticks to crops and contributes to plant protection. One of the main reasons they spray so much is because a majority of what they spray simply bounces or rolls off of plants due to their natural water repellency, and this leads to an enormous amount of pollution and waste. This over spraying has terrible costs. In addition to the deaths that I mentioned earlier, pesticide pollution is linked to anywhere between five and 385 million acute illnesses every single year, causing diseases like cancer, neurological conditions, and birth defects. Pesticides pollute all parts of the environment with up to 90% of agricultural water streams in the US being contaminated with them. And they also represent a giant economic cost. Globally, farms spend about $60 billion a year on pesticides as they can contribute to up to 30% of the production cost of certain crops. Agzan Cloak is a new generation of agricultural sprays that prevents pesticides from bouncing off of plants and polluting the environment. By cloaking each droplet with a minute quantity of a plant-based oil, we promote droplet retention on even the most water repellent of plant surfaces. Here on the left, we see a conventional agricultural nozzle spraying onto a cabbage leaf for three seconds. As you can see, a majority of what's sprayed is simply bouncing off. In contrast with the Agzan cloak system, we can achieve much better coverage in a third of the spray time, leading to drastic reductions in waste. We can easily retrofit existing sprayers with our cloaking system, and it presents a universal, inexpensive, and environmentally sustainable way to limit pesticide overuse and waste. We've already begun retrofitting sprayers with our technology and field testing our cloaking methodology on a wide range of crops uh, here in Massachusetts. And we hope to drastically reduce the amount of pesticides that farmers need to spray to protect their crops.